is not my first rodeo. <laughs> <laughs> He's <a> like, <laughs> oh dear. Uh, 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 uh. No, that's really bad. Okay. <laughs> Do not move. Thank you very much, sir. I found it really good to be back on campus. Um, get a bit more of a social experience, like back with your friends, having lectures um, and having things in person has been really nice. It's been challenging working on site during the lockdown due to minimal staff, but we've been very lucky. We've all teamed together and uh, we've all done well. It's been really lovely to have the students back. It's really what makes my job. It's nice to see actual people. My favourite thing about being on campus this time of year is all like the outdoor spaces like as we transition into like autumn and winter. We have a really nice campus and especially at this time of year it looks really pretty. Probably the decorations. I think the decorations just make you feel Christmassy. Uh, so I'm really excited to put them up. We're putting them up on Monday. Everyone will be involved so it'll be a good team morale and uh, it'll be very exciting. My favourite bit about Southampton at this time of year is also the lights and how beautiful it is, the pantos, the celebrations that go on. It's just a really exciting place to be all year round, but particularly during the festive season. We went on our kind of astronomy night out, saw the new PhD students, postdocs, staff members like myself. We all went to Winchester uh, for the evening to kind of get to know each other better and that was really fun. And they were switching on the Christmas lights, so we got to see that as well. I think next year, um, just, I hope I would meet new people, like more people, but yeah, that's, that's what it is, yeah. Personally, um, I'm actually trying to get started on a new book, so I hope to get, I don't think I'll achieve finishing it by the end of the year, but uh, I hope to get uh, very much further into that. Uh, for 2022, I hope to climb Ben Nevis. It's always been a really cool dream of mine, and I think now is the time to do it. During November, December, we celebrate Hanukkah. It's the Jewish festival of light. We celebrate a miracle that happened a few thousand years ago. But the whole idea is that the miracle is within people's hearts. So the question is always, what is your miracle? What is your talent? What is your hope for the next year? See, I'm a Christian and I do celebrate Christmas, you know, and sort of, you know, we pray and stuff. But yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. I'm non-religious. I'm an evolutionary biologist, I'm a paleobiologist, I'm looking at my fossils, and I'm working on dinosaurs. And birds are dinosaurs. So I like to think of Christmas as being the ultimate representation of the mammal's victory over the dinosaurs as across the country we sit down to eat turkey. It's about family and friends, so being together and have, have a joy together yeah, to keep us warm to get through the winter. Have a wonderful break and a happy year.